The Story of the Special Little Wire by Electromech. There once was a little wire who was happy and had a cheerful soul. To be part of an aircraft wiring system had always been his goal. He would look up and see the airplanes fly, and he would always think, if someone could just put me in there, I know I can be an important link. He was lightweight and lean, only a couple of pounds per thousand feet. As a little guy, quite small, he could achieve a bend radius only a few could meet. But would they let him in, he asked. There were big ones, hot ones, and flexible cable ones, too. Surely there would be room for all. Would the design engineer let him through? The big cables carried the power, and they were strong enough to help the airplane soar. When they carried the alternating current, they were typically bundled in groups of four. The flexible cables were like gymnasts. They could twist and bend and touch their toes. It was impressive and exciting. But just how they do it, nobody really knows. Fire zone wires were like action heroes. Through flame and fire, they would remain intact. We would look at them in amazement and think that's definitely how we should act. The coax cables were isolated and kept on their own. They had their job and needed no one's permission. You wouldn't dare to try mess with them or you would find there would be a loss of transmission. The grounding straps would lay around and many thought they were extremely lazy. But they would spring into action the moment they were needed. The surges of lightning current they could handle was utterly crazy. High voltage cables had insulation quite stout. Testing was harsh, everyone would agree. You always had to make sure that the HVCs would remain PD free. And the little wire did not know if there is anywhere on the airplane he would fit. I guess I'll just have to wait here, and on this storage rack, I will have to sit. Then one day, an airplane engineer said, Hey, little guy, you're gonna have to see, when we bundle you with some others like you, just how important you can be. And so the little wire made new friends. Around them was placed one of many jacket types. The little wire could soon be part of a data cable, becoming a critical link for endless data bytes. The bundle was then measured and trimmed, the little wire's excitement he could not contain. With a special connector at both of its ends, he and his new buddies were finally going onto a plane. Now the little wire was quite thrilled. Each time the plane took off and went really high, the quality of that little data cable made sure hundreds of people could safely fly. In the end, what we learned, it doesn't matter if you are big or little. Each wire is beautifully unique, and that is why every wire is special. From Letromech, the home of EWIS testing and analysis, we wish you all a happy and safe holiday season.